The jury saw autopsy photos of Lisa Caldwell Teckle's body Wednesday afternoon as the Seth Teckle murder trial continued on its eighth day at the Henry County Courthouse in Mount Pleasant. Chief State Medical Examiner Julia Gooden took the stand for the prosecution. Gooden examined Lisa's body after the after her murder on May 26, 2012, and confirmed that Lisa's death was a homicide and was caused by a gunshot wound to the chest area. There were tears and turned heads from Caldwell family members in the courtroom as the graphic photos were shown, and Seth Tecca lowered his head and covered his mouth. Gooden said that the deer slug ripped through three of Lisa's ribs and severed an artery. She said that Lisa's unborn child had no obvious abnormalities and that Lisa was 15 to 20 weeks pregnant. There were no defense wounds, and the wound was consistent with Lisa laying on her right side when shot. Lisa and the child died very quickly within minutes of being shot because the slug hit Lisa's left lung and she couldn't breathe. Gooden said that it is very hard to detect the exact time that someone dies. The slug that killed Lisa entered under her armpit and fragments went through her lung. The angle of the wound was consistent with being shot from the foot of the bed as she slept. The prosecution is expected to present evidence from a DNA expert late Wednesday afternoon. For Otama Radio, I'm James Grob.